Here's a quick video recap of the inequalities involving absolute value. The absolute value of x is greater than or equal to 2 means that the distance from 0 is greater than or equal to 2. Looking at the number line, you can see that the distance from 0 is greater than or equal to 2 and also less than or equal to 2. Also, you can remember that the ones that are greater than, greater sounds like great or, those will always be an or, meaning that the number line will move in opposite directions or diverge. Great, great or than, or going in opposite directions because you have to be both greater than 2 and less than negative 2. Greater is or. Also, you can think about it as the distance from 0 being the absolute value of x minus 0. It's the distance from 0 because subtracting 0, uh, you're still at 0. The absolute value being greater than 2, this is the same thing as above. Distance from 0, distance from 0. However, if I write it like this, this means that the distance from 2, because we're subtracting, it's the, the difference, the difference between a number and 2, that's the distance. So now, it's the distance from 2 must be less than 1. Less than is an and, so the number line is going to be coming together. If we solve this, the solutions are x is less than 3 and x is greater than 1. So if you're less than 3 and greater than 1, it's coming together. So again, on the number line, we're going to see that's the distance from 2, and it's got to be less than 1 on both sides. There is the distance from 2, look, 2 is in the middle, and the distance is less than 1 on each side, so you're between 1 and 3. Hopefully this makes a little bit more sense now.